tech recommendations and especially PC part recommendations are time-based. Something that was good six months ago might not be good in another six months. This might be obvious to some of you, but to many people, it's actually not. I often see people post builds that they are planning to buy in six to eight months, and I always say, just make sure to double check the prices when the time comes. One reason I'm saying this is a lot of the comments in my videos complaining about 8 gigabyte GPUs in 2025 are people saying stuff like, I have a 3070 with 8 gigabytes and it treats me good. And I'm just like, am I stupid? Guys, just because you bought an 8 gig GPU two, three, four, five years ago doesn't matter. The point is that 8 gigabyte GPUs are coming out today in 2025 for 300 to 350 dollars. This means that anyone who wants to build a PC today with not the fanciest budget and who is too scared to buy used and they like to play normal AAA games, they might not have as good an experience as they could have if Nvidia and AMD could stop being greedy motherfuckers. Holy shit, it's not that hard. I hate this fucking BB can. And don't tell me VRAM chips are expensive. I don't care. Nvidia put 12 gigabytes in the fucking 3060. The 3060 at one point was the highest VRAM in the 30 series right under the 3090. It was so stupid. And I am 9000% sure the only reason they did that is because AMD put 16 gigs of VRAM in the 6800 and 6800 XT. Everyone was crazy about that. The hype was real about how AMD was gonna bitch slap Nvidia. So Nvidia put 12 gigs. Not on the 3080, not the 3070, not the 3060 Ti, because those were all out already. On the fucking 3060. And ironically, reviewers gave them shit for that. <laughs> So it's all about competition. Nvidia are the superior product, they know it. They have the entire industry by the balls, they know it. And AMD are not being aggressive enough. I don't know what they have in their head, but 